First three sixteens only. Eight and go from Mike. Set. You must get to count four and flat, or it's gonna look different from person to person. You guys gotta want this for you, not for us, right? We haven't done that one in a while, so I'm gonna forget that happened. You wanna buzz through your stuff, play it through your leap height. Which means some of you need to require a little more velocity from here to here. Yeah, I'll take that. Yeah, I'll take that. Take an adjust. And stand by. A new era surrounds around the idea of progression, pushing this band forward. It's about a transition from the old to the new. In the show, we had a lot of actually traditional and non-traditional things. I mean, we had our classical pieces, we had Medea to start out, and also You'll Never Walk Alone. But we also had some weirder things, New Era Dance and Knights of Sidonia towards the end of the show, which consisted of an electric guitar, um, weird dubstepy sounds, body on the field, dancing, clapping. The crowd loves it, and that's the most important thing, you know, is to have a great show and to entertain. And I can completely say that we've done that this year. It literally took shift into a new era of this program, and I think it's just gonna continue on into future years. I feel like the show has to do a lot with change and how you need to be able to accept change. I feel like that's something that every person needs to accept, and it's almost like a life lesson Learning that here through Marching Man and through our show has taught us more and more about what we're gonna face outside of Marching Man, and it just teaches us to keep moving forward because nothing's ever gonna be the perfect situation, but you have to know how to make the most out of it. We made the most out of our show. We made the most out of being with each other. We made the most out of the changes that were handed to us. It's created the perfect picture for us to move on and to push forward and we'll come back again every single year stronger and stronger because of the changes that we've had to face along the way. Many people, they come in the beginning and they come see us and they're like, why am I doing this? You're, you're using hours and hours of your time for a seven minute show. But once you're done performing, you feel this sense of accomplishment that you get from nowhere else. And it's amazing how so many people can come together to make something so beautiful. Everyone comes into this band and they are themselves. They don't fake anything. They're not someone they're not. And they turn into a marching titan because they turn into a person who loves their fellow bandmates. And that is something that I became. It's one of the only organizations I can say where I've never met anyone that is a bad person, never met anyone who's conceited or full of themselves. Everyone's just open and they all love each other and they all want to push each other to do the best they possibly can. I was sitting on the bus and we pulled into the parking lot and yeah, we were surrounded by a million coach buses and a million school buses with all the bands just getting ready like it was a normal competition. 
but I took one look at that stadium and I was like, this is it. Like, we are going to crush today. There was a feeling of accomplishment even before we performed. We got to this point where we finished the show and there's nothing else that can change how great we will be. And the amount of confidence everyone had before we stepped on was amazing. That confidence is what got us to where we were. Every time you put on your band uniform, you just, you feel proud of everything you've accomplished and everything you do and try to work towards the same goal as everyone else and work together to achieve greatness. Marching Titans, I welcome you to the national finals. This will be our final destination in our long journey together this year. And man, what a journey has it been. This band was broken. And I think it's fixed now. And it's not because of me, it's not because of the staff, but it's because you chose to fix it. And that's just another reason why the Marching Titans prevail. And that's why this show is so special. So enjoy it together one last time. Can we do that? Yeah. Yes. I think every word that he said hit that group like a thousand pounds. And I think everyone in the band just kind of recognized, like, this is it. We can take this and show them what we're made of. Having a, a core song, a, a marching band song, strictly in itself is, I believe, extremely important. It unites the whole band before we perform and invigorates all of us to do the best we can. We become one being, we become one band. The lyrics of You Never Walk Alone, they mean a lot to me because they've helped me get through everything that's happened and it means that I have family to come back to when I need them. <laughs> and that I can get through these times and know that they'll be better in the end. Becoming a marching titan has given me the opportunity to be something I could never be alone. And you step out onto that field and you look up to the lights and you see everyone that's there for you and you think, this is what I'm meant to do. This is who I'm meant to be. 
I don't think I would actually be who I am in general, and I couldn't be more thankful. I'm stronger mentally, physically. I know that I can succeed and I can go forward in life with the confidence that I've now gained. If I could say anything to a marching member of year one, it would definitely be two simple words, and that is thank you, because they really shaped this program. They started this program and inadvertently made what it is today. I hope you're proud of us and what we've accomplished. I hope you feel as proud as you were when you were a marching titan. To be a great marching band, you need to follow the goal of perfection. While this goal is unattainable, the ideals that surround it are what shape a great marching band. But in the end, it really means that you have achieved something for yourself, that you're proud of yourself, that you've made a goal and you've improved as a person, or as a musician, or as a band member, or as a leader. I think it's really unique when you can say that you have a group of 74 people that are so tightly knitted together that they can accomplish something as big as we did this year. No one will ever walk alone as long as they're part of this group.